Body camera recordings show police chase, tase, and arrest a man they say is a familiar face. Good evening, I'm Paul Cicchini. And I'm Jessica Coons. From traffic stops to homicides, Decatur police say the city has a problem with guns. In the wake of a deadly shooting yesterday, the police chief says he's worried about gang retaliation. WCI3's Jen Lask has the story. Well, anytime we have a, have a homicide, um, we worry about retaliation. Anytime we have a shooting, we worry about retaliation. Decatur Chief Jim Getz says Keontre Milan was killed in retaliation for a deadly shooting in Springfield. He's calling on dueling gangs to find other ways to solve their problems. We want everybody to put their guns down. We want everybody to try to find a way to come to a resolution without shooting each other. Anti-violence advocate Elijah England is also worried people are taking punishments into their own hands. There is a, a big common concern uh, among the members of the community that if they do not carry a weapon, if they are not and somehow involved in this gang war um, that they could be in danger. As police try to get guns off the streets. What's your name, man? Tyreek O'Gary. Tyreek O'Gary. A traffic stop on Thursday the 18th leads Decatur officers to Tyreek O'Gary. Mr. Gary, he, he's one of the people that we know is very active in the, the, the gun violence in Decatur. Here's what happens when police ask if he's armed. <laughs> They take him into custody, booking him on multiple charges, including resisting arrest. It's one less gun, but Getz says when it comes to addressing the root causes behind the violence, it's going to take more than just the police. Other people in the community step up and do their part. We have no choice but to be reactive at this point. Reporting, I'm Jen Lask, WCIA 3, your local news leader. Decatur's mayor released a statement tonight. She says the city will do what's necessary to keep people safe, even if that means asking for more help from the FBI and state police. In 2020, the cities of Decatur, Champaign, Urbana, and Peoria all saw rises in shooting incidents, people shot, and people killed by guns. Only Peoria saw fewer gun-related homicides last year compared to 2019.